let's move on to our next question. Right here. So the question asks to turn 270 degrees to radians. So 270 degrees to radian is our question. Uh, okay. So two formulas that we're going to we might be using when converting from degrees to radian or radian to degrees is this one. So if you want to turn from degrees to degrees to radian, you take the degree. I'm just going to use the blue color so it's easier. Take the degree and you times it by pi over 180 degrees. And then there you go, you get your rad or radian. If you want to turn from radian to degrees, you're going to have to do the opposite. So you're going to have to shake the radian and you're going to have to times it by 180 degrees and divide that by pi and there you get your degrees. So in this question, in our example, we're going to be using the first formula right here, this one, and we're going to take 270 degrees and we're going to times it by pi over 180 degrees which equals to 270 pi over 180 And the degree sign on both the ends cancel out. So again, we're just left with 180, uh, sorry, 270 pi over 180. Now we can further simplify that by dividing. So the easiest to divide by is by 10. So we're just gonna get rid of the zeros and we're left with 27 over 18 pi, which can then be turned into 27 over 18 pi. This can be further divided by, let's say, mm -hmm. 3, and if we divide each of the, because you have to divide the numerator with the same number, you divide the denominator. Whatever you do to the numerator, you have to do it to the denominator. And so if we divide that 27 by 3, we're left with 9 over 18 divided by 3 is 6, and don't forget the pi. We can further divide this, because it has to be in the simplest form, by 3 again. And we are left with three over two pi. So you can put that in your calculator in radian and figure the value out, but for uh, figure like the approximate value, but this is the exact value for that question. Okay. So